the Honduras National Congress will revise the proposed general budget for 2016. Some say that this is an opportunity to change some aspects of it. For example, the concentration in the projects managed directly by the president instead of increasing budgets for things such as health, education and public investment. For 2016, Honduras will have a general budget of $7.7 .7 billion. Of this, President Juan Hernandez will have the control of 65% or approximately $4.6 billion for his programs. There will be enough money for other programs which are short of funding, such as public health and public education, which are facing a very precarious situation. There are some lines and priorities that are dictated directly from the president in almost all terms. The question is how much planning really exists and if the plans that are oriented in terms of being expenses aiming for development or are they just expenses that come to cover other priorities that are not necessarily of development but instead are part of a strategy to gain popularity and not to develop the country. Even though the government is obligated to present the new budget no later than September 15, still very few offices have presented reports on the spending of the last budget. We are really worried because at this time there are no reports on expenses. Only 13 of 45 public offices have presented their reports on how they used the last budget. We are worried of how 65% of the last budget was used by the executive power. And we see that for this year, President Juan Hernandez is attempting to take even more control of funds and use it for his presidential programs. The budget has to be approved before December 31st this year, and the political opposition is attempting to unify and try to reorient the budget toward the programs that currently are in crisis, instead of using that money for the president's political agenda that points to hold on to power illegally without any democratic consultation, using militarization and political activism based on support programs. Gerardo Torres, Telesur. Central America.